My name is Bjorn. I'm nice a to meet fan. you. How are Thank you. you. How are you? I'm very good. Actually, I read that. I read that article and uh, that chef bashing you or whatever. Uh huh. That's ridiculous. Uh, anyway, I just want. I'm no, sorry again no. to disturb you. No, it's good no worries you. at all. Thank you. This, this happened twice today. Never happens. No. Some other dude was like, I'm on your side too. It's nice. I had to get over people hating me on the internet. I, that I learned was gonna happen. Every time that something comes out on me, there's gonna be one or two people who just, it rubs them the wrong way and decided there's, there's nothing I can do about it that's gonna make it go away. Hello. I'm here to talk about kind of the new culture of, of chefs. The traditional system of becoming a chef is you kind of put your head down for 10, 20 years, work your way up the ranks, and now what you see with pop-ups as well as social media and the internet and all this has really disrupted that. Why is it still only acceptable to become a chef one way? You look, the industry is mostly men who are in a kitchen together, they yell at each other, they tease each other, which, yes, is part of it. But does it really have to be part of it? I think as kind of the next generation, why would we hinder new chefs from coming into this, from being inspired? The industry's changing so much, but there are still parts of it that are so set in its ways. Why does it have to stay that way? 